Alright guys, and girls, I totally got this. I'm not dead. That's the most important thing in this game. I've killed one whole conservative, and uh, I've uh, taxed more money than I spent. So I'm near dead. That's that's a thing. That's a problem. That's gonna make this uh, this next shit just a little bit more awkward, courtesy of the fact that, well, I'm gonna be bleeding to death. It's gonna be an unfortunate circumstance, but I do need to continue to be active and do things. Uh, I just won't be uh, fighting in the process of doing so. I'm gonna start going to places now and uh, begin looking for mutants in the hopes of basically having lots of people to talk to and potentially recruit. My characteristics are pretty fucked, uh, given my current situation. The fact that I'm near dead has uh, really completely crushed me. Uh, nevertheless, I need to do something. I do just hate to uh, sit and dawdle, so... Unfortunately, we're gonna get a lot of bitching about the fact that, well, I'm nearly dead. And I went to the wrong fucking place, really. Ah, uh, shame on me. Uh, this was not the best place to go looking for mutants. This would have been more along the lines of, like, say, something like the Crack House, which I'm actually in control of. Let's just talk to people, period. And, which is gonna be immensely hard for me to do so, considering the fact that my charisma is down to, like, two. Uh, I do not have a lot of faith. But I'll, uh, go ahead and, uh, test some shit, of course. You know, maybe, uh, try to open a lock in the process. Something like that. I actually opened a fucking door. Oh, man. That's amazing. I opened another one. I can't believe I'm doing this. Of course, again, things are gonna be pretty damn hard. Uh, courtesy of the fact that, well... I'm nearly fucking dead. That's a, that's a problem. <laughs> Who knew? Okay. Um, don't want to risk going in there to attempt to steal something. And I'd rather stick close to the exit. Uh, just in case uh, people start getting suspicious. Also looking for folks to maybe talk to. Nope. 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 Definitely not those people either. Here we go, a mutant. The government is systematically... <laughs> yeah, I've got practically no ability to talk to these people. It's... it's ugly. And especially considering the fact that, uh, my virtual avatar is gonna be bitching the entire time we're here. Oh! I'm still managing to attract a few people. Well, just one thus far. So I have that going for me. Just wanna be able to build up my characteristics in some other form of fashion. Of course, I could spend an entire month or two or however long it takes to fully heal. It's, it takes many years, unless this was changed, for the arch-conservatives to actually threaten to win the game, even in an arch-conservative nightmare. Uh, consequently, you can really take a lot of time, and it's perfectly okay. <laughs> Where did the epic voice go? It went away whenever I started screaming like a bitch. Very sad. Uh, nevertheless, we're still alive. I do believe I ultimately made the right decision with, with diving out when I did, because I didn't die. That is the sole justification for that. <laughs> uh, begins losing faith in God. I'm a violent criminal. Now, some of you might be wondering, why are you not bringing your weaponry with you? It's because uh, martial arts is very handy to have, uh, because uh, you're not carrying around a weapon, so you're always lethal with your fists. I also want to have a lot... I want combat to last longer, uh, so that I can train up my dodge, which is very fucking useful. And it's much better to train up your dodge against people who can't hurt you, versus people who could one-shot you. Uh, regardless... We, uh, we're definitely not in a horrible situation. The game's gotten a little bit harder, because I'm nearly dead, but rest assured, we'll be fine, folks. I like to fight through adversity. Nothing wrong with that. Gotta make this shit harder. Four meetings? We'll go ahead and try to work in one more here. 
I said, we're gonna go ahead and try to work in one more here. Again, I went to the wrong fucking location. But I'm kind of determined now, and I'm just trying to fight it out. <laughs> what I really wanted is, again, I like to... Uh, folks who've followed along with me, uh, particularly on the last adventure I did of this, uh, the Liberal Crime Squad Reborn series, know that I like to hire mutants, because they have a vast... Oh, shit. I didn't mean to uh, try to seduce her. <laughs> Whoops. I'm in no condition to be doing that shit. <laughs> but it did increase my seduction by, plus, by you know, 0 .04, so that's something. Always the best time to seduce someone whenever you're near death, mean. Just look at six days of sacrifice, folks. I could spend a lot of time of my life trying to slowly work up seduction here, too. How about I save that for a time whenever I'm not bleeding out of every orifice? Just casually chat, of course. None of these folks are convinced I really understand the problem. But Sabrina Button there is still hanging with me, which is pretty nice. I've actually got over a point of persuasion now, which is going to make my life easier. I'd particularly like to get someone who had first aim. That'd be useful. But, I'm not expecting Christmas miracles. Now, let's go ahead and actually head to the crack house instead of the housing projects. I got confused because it was a safe house of mine. No, I'm just there to cause trouble. I don't want it to become my permanent safe house. Alright, mutant, we're off to a good start. I not off for a moment. Two scheduled meetings. No. No, goddammit. as epic music plays in the background. I figured I'd actually listen to music for a change while playing Liberal Crime Squad. It's not like the game has any sounds of its own. And I didn't feel like playing silently this morning. By this morning, I mean it's nearly four in the morning. God damn it. And I also wanted to give uh, folks some time to uh, get a good look at Oni before I uploaded more videos of it. As opposed to my usual tactic of Crushing all of your dreams. The flag is stupid. God damn it. Shit wouldn't be so hard if I wasn't nearly dead. <laughs> Definitely made this very interesting on myself. Alright. Dude, it's like totally bumming me. Four. Five. And let's go ahead and hit on you. I'm a pig. No. Woo. Go ahead and hit on you now. Let's hit on you. And you. Because you might as well. It'll increase your seduction no matter what, so... Go ahead and hit on everything you see. <laughs> Important lessons of life from Grimith. Besides, since my skill is so low, I don't actually have to worry about, you know, not my skill combination of my skill and my characteristics, I don't have to worry about someone actually accepting. I don't want that to happen. It would be bad. I don't actually want to seduce any of these people. I want people who would actually be valuable members on the team. You know, someone who wasn't nearly dying would be a good start, huh? And if one of these actually does succeed, that would be very amusing. Alright, 0 0.72, we're close. And you... Oh. Alright, this should be enough to get me over. Prostitute. I'm a pig. Call me a pig. Rude. <laughs> Alright, sorry. Press the wrong key. 90.95, rather. Had to do one more. Transient. You were chosen, and now I have a full point in seduction. Go ahead and casually talk with you people. I don't really understand the problem, unfortunately. Thankfully, though, uh, Sabrina there understands the problem. She's actually not that bad, all things considered. Especially since she's ready to fight for the liberal cause. But I'll keep, uh, keep stringing her along, basically. Alright. The primary reason, just simply why I don't like to have 
my liberals go to places to get healed is that, yeah, it really does take them out of the action for a long period of time, particularly if it's my only liberal. It's an unfortunate situation, that's for sure. Let's go forth to stop evil at the, um, well, let's go back to the crack house again. Uh, let's go ahead and cause trouble. I still love Mama. I really want to go after mutants here. And, uh, hopefully I can have good things happen to me in life. I'll go ahead and hit on you. <laughs> Slowly increase the seduction as well. I'm looking forward to a time where, uh... Well, if I wanted to keep doing that, I should just, uh... Try to seduce everyone. Again, you know, just improving my statistics in slow and painful ways. And not exactly the most efficient, but I'm near death. And I'm too much of a man to give up on this character. I don't give up in Liberal Crime Squad unless I have to. No pussy. Made this game my bitch so many times. And back whenever I didn't know what I was doing, this game made me uh, its bitch. So there's that. Losing is fun, according to uh, A12 Games, but goddammit, I don't want to lose. It's uh, machismo here. Besides, it's it's interesting to show you all the near-death uh, lines, isn't it? And what completely fucking epic music to do this to. It's completely un unfitting at all. <laughs> uh, Deslakota's Oxide Temple, which was a, uh, a cover of a song of a friend. Uh, Deslakota is also known as Risen LP. He follows along with... Uh, the D&D 3.5 live stream, which is going to be taking place about 12 hours. I won't exactly have a whole lot of time to sleep after work. <laughs> Mistakes were made. <laughs> Things happen. You know how it goes, folks. Maybe you don't. I'm clutching at the wounds. Still trying to recover from the fact that I was fucking shot. <laughs> Alright, I got mutants here. The flag is stupid! The fact that I have intelligence of five. Come on, I can totally do this, right? There we go. Let's go ahead and wait here. We have some prostitutes we can try to seduce, but I'm a pig. And there we go. We will stop worrying about seduction for the time being, because my charisma is capped at two while I'm near dead. Come on, mutants. Now I'm just looking for mutants. Who will hopefully stick with me through thick and thin. Although, that one's probably a bit iffy. Considering the fact that I really don't, I'm really not going to be able to do a good job of persuading anyone. 13 minutes of this dumb shit. Why to go, Grandma? Well, I'm not wasting my time, according to how I feel about the situation, so... As long as I'm not wasting my time, that's the only thing that matters. Okay, let's go ahead and leave. Casually chat here with Martin Sky. Of course, he's convinced I don't really understand the problem. Same there. Skeptical on some of Gro's arguments, but did not immediately leave. And that's an achievement in and of itself. And finally, Sabrina Button here. Um. Got good heart. She'd at least be another body. But she doesn't have any first aid. Eh. She's skeptical of some of my arguments. At any point, you know, I could have recruited her. But I'm just. I, I've got the world on a string here. Sitting on a rainbow. Now, I suppose I could, since I really can't improve persuasion anymore, just fuck around with security, or I can quit being a bitch. How about that? How about stop being a bitch, Grimoth? Um... How about... We... Hmm. Whatever. I don't want you to actually do that anyway. There should be, like, some sort of fucking classroom somewhere, right? That's one of these new fangled introductions into the game, right? I don't want to go to that. I thought there was a new teaching thing that was put in, uh, where you could just go to classes, or... Maybe I'm thinking about 
uh, some of the stuff that Dion did with his gen mod, and that was never actually put into the game here. That would have been nice. Thought I would, you know, actually get some instruction on, uh, you know, I don't know, fucking healing myself. <laughs> you first aid. Or just, you know, actually go to classes in general. I'm definitely not going to the free clinic. I can get fucked. I can engage in fundraising. <laughs> Since I'm actually wanted for crime, that'd be a terrible idea. Hmm. I don't have any computer skill with this character, unfortunately. Definitely don't want to do any of that. Uh, definitely don't want to try to steal a car, that'd be terrible. I don't have anyone to teach. Let's go ahead and put you in a vehicle, man. Let's see here. Well, shit, guys. Uh, my character will eventually heal over time. I just uh, wanted to him have something to do. Eh. And I can't go out. Uh, only because I'm afraid this character would die. I'm not afraid. I just don't want it to happen. Well, huh. Sorry, folks. I'm just, uh... Scrunching my brows here, trying to think of something interesting for my character to do while we wait for him to heal. Uh, let's go ahead and, um... Really can't solicit donations with this character. It'd be interesting if I did something stupid like Sketch. <laughs> oh, you know what the hell. Selling art? Income depends on art skill and is lower if the country is very liberal. Activity trains art may have a positive political effect if done well enough. Uh, income depends on tailoring. Both of my tailoring is... Suppose I could try to make clothes. I don't have enough money to make clothes. That's stupid, Griffin. Don't be stupid. Excuse me. I had some interesting things happening there with my throat. Yeah, I don't have enough money to really do that effectively. I can just go to the pawn shop. And sell my stuff that I have. That's what I was gonna do anyway, before I try to get teaching done. Let's go ahead and head to Brooks Pawn and Gun. And sell um all the stuff that I have here. I don't need the extra cloak. I might. No, I'll go ahead. I need every little bit of money I can get. There we go, that gets me some cash. Done paying. I'll go ahead and, uh, liberal tools. <laughs> Could use a fucking guitar. I don't have any skill in music, though. Spray paint might be useful for purposes of graffiti, but I don't feel like doing that. Crowbar is always handy. Go ahead and keep one around just in case. It's not a bad thing to have. Force open doors. Isaac here will take a lot of persuasion. He does have some training computers, but ugh, he's terrible. Look at all those threes. Still, he's hanging around. Art and religion. So it's not a bad thing to just continue to talk to you. You'll uh, train up my religion, which isn't a horribly bad thing. Uh, religion's not something you can train up, and it's not really something that gets applied a whole lot, except for the purposes of interrogation, I think. I'll uh, continue to string that along, and I might find some other people to string along, too. So basically, forget everything that I've been doing up to this fucking point. Let's go find some more people to try to string along. <laughs> Let's go to the housing projects to do that. Because why not? I'm using my sports car. Let's go ahead and uh, unequip that, because I can't afford to get into a car chase. I couldn't exactly afford to get into a foot chase, either. That'd kill me, too. Whatever. Let's go. Go ahead and uh, just pick some locks here. I'm doing a fairly nice job of it, all things considered. Surprisingly so. Just to train up some security, because rest assured, I'm going to be needing security as well. Uh, make no mistake about that. 
the very one of the very many the many very useful skills. Haven't gotten into an encounter yet either, which is pretty interesting as well. Um, let's go ahead and uh, hang around the exit now. I just strike up conversations with people in the hopes that they can maybe uh, teach my character here just some random statistics about, say, business or you know stuff like that, or science or religion. Because why the hell not? And if you know I can actually find a worthy mutant, that wouldn't be bad either. 20 minutes in, and what the fuck are you doing, Grimoth? <laughs> oh, had a little bit of interesting lag there, apparently, with Liberal Prime Squad, of all things. I don't know why the hell that happened, but it did. Maybe it was just some sort of quirky craziness with my recorder. Alright, let's go ahead and just talk. These people are regretting agreeing to the situation, unfortunately, uh... I'm just not that great of a character at uh, keeping these people hanging on, and we ultimately achieve nothing there. So it was basically a waste of everyone's time. Congratulations, waste of time! Let's go back to the housing projects again. Pretty damn determined to hang on to this thing. No, I don't want to force open the door. You think I am fucking crazy? A, I have a strength of one. I ain't getting anywhere with that. B, I'm not in a situation where... Oh, shit. Fucking encounters and the fact that I'm constantly spamming cries of horror. <laughs> Goodness. Well, the game certainly kicked me in the fucking teeth, so good job, game. I can't risk going into those places for any loot at all. I'd never be able to escape in a chase with death squad officers. With an agility of two, I would be dead in the water. No matter how close this Oh damn it, there's two mutants there. Gonna try to talk to them. I regret everything. Don't you fucking chortle at me, Virtual Grimoth. Fucking I bastard. Killer, and I always have been. Indeed I they have. Say once you taste blood, it changes you forever. Had a little freeze there oh, again. Yeah. Don't know why that's happening. Since day I'm confused. What He's never fucking done that to me before. Ask. I wouldn't Maybe it has, I've just forgotten. I've never had any other choice. I have always, always followed orders. orders. I'm taking, taking another, another man's, man's life. life. All I can what say it is, it's both, both easier and more difficult, difficult than you might imagine. imagine. Alright, that was fun. Come on! You know you want to have a meeting with me. Meet with Grandma. It's a meet and greet. I'm still bleeding here and dying. Well, I'm not bleeding. Definitely not. I'm still sobbing in horrible pain. The secret is actually that my character is a masochist. <laughs> he thrives on this. Indeed. It's possible that I could just bribe these people with a bunch of money to get them to uh, remain in conversation with me. But, uh, probably not do that. Getting some religion and science and law there. Not bad. Ah, goddammit. Come on! One more mutant. Or one more liberal, rather. Who can promptly refuse me. As soon as I get out of here. Here we go, prostitute. Be good. Interested in learning more? Kiki Connor. Fantastic. And Leonard there kind of regrets agreeing to this, but he still found me to be insightful. Uh, not so much Derek, though. And Juliet is is gonna hang around another time. He's like Swift there. Swift, rather. Just go ahead and keep talking to you. We have five scheduled meetings. Not bad. Okay. Um, here's what we're gonna do, folks. Go ahead and, uh... Sell portrait sketches. Gonna be fun. Probably not going to get much of anything from this, given the fact that the country is so ensconced in conservatism, but it's just something to do to pass the time. We did get a little bit of money, that's something. Kiki there feels something needs to be done. A Leonard's going to need to take a lot of persuading, and oh my goodness, his characteristics are horrible. Uh, Juliet's still hanging out, and so is Isaac. 
breakdown, music, sweet. Still have five meetings, which is awesome. And uh, I am now only badly wounded. So you see, I hung in there, I didn't go into the hospital, and very slowly but surely my liberal wounds have knitted themselves together. It's only taken 25 minutes of bullshit, but now I have room to increase so many more characteristics, folks. Look at that. Good times. Let's go ahead and... And definitely I'm going to be far more persuasive now than what I was. Just got to make sure I press the right keys. Just go ahead and keep passing time here. And I'm slowly earning a trickle of money here. Ah, uh, Juliet's finally done with me. Ah, uh, well. That's fun. Enter the Shredder indeed. If you're ready to fight for the liberal cause, I'm not ready to have any of you along. Isaac there has some nice computer skill, and it's definitely nice to have a person with computer skill on the team. But I'm just not up for that. I'm up for is just continuing to increase my stats, man. It's all about the stats, baby. I'm ghost like Swayze. It makes sense at all. What the fuck are you talking about? The fucking Inner to Shredder song, man. It's making my head go crazy. And I have no idea why I'm bothering to increase my art skill, really, but it's a thing. Transpiring. Can't be helped. Let's go ahead and actually uh, maybe get myself up to wounded here, perhaps. Stay in conversation here long enough. Unless another person leaves me, then I'll go out into the world again and try to learn great things. Religion slowly going up there. Good music! We're doing that shit! <laughs> You're messing with Grimma's head. Don't you fucking laugh at me. Shit's not funny. <laughs> do, 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 do. And of course, I'm being very careful with my, uh, my key presses. I don't want to walk into a horrible situation where I'm actually getting pursued by police officers. I pressed the wrong fucking key. And then we all laugh at my expense. Although with... Oh, hey! Agility is 6 now. Everything has gone great. So, we're looking at 27 and a half minutes of time that I spent there. Slowly healing my body with no first aid uh, help at all. You know, I found some time. Increased a variety of characteristics. Persuasion is going sky high while I just talk with these people. That's not a bad thing to do. I just chat with them as my body knits itself together. Now, coming back next time on Let's Get On With The Liberal Crime Squad, well, I'm not gonna go fight again, but I'm gonna take more risks uh, now that my character has decent attributes again, and I don't have to worry so much about the game constantly bitching at me. So that's a thing, folks. And... Eh, I'll go until the... Nah, fuck this song. We're done.